Good morning. Good afternoon, y'all. Welcome to the mental house with me. Um, I want to send a prayer out today to all uh, people affected in California. Iconic uh, fire, the second one, worst fire in um, the history of burnings, I guess. Um, and I really want to uh, make sure that I acknowledge that these people are suffering and I would hope that they can stay safe and not lose too much in this latest raging out of control fire. Oh, they said over 50,000 acres have already burned. Um, but an ancient stand of the world's tallest trees has fallen victim to California's raging wildfire. The CZU and the SCU complex fires near Santa Cruz have ravaged Big Basin State Park. Big Basin is California's oldest state park and home to the largest continuous stand of ancient coast redwoods south of San Francisco. Some of the giant redwoods there are among are more than 50 feet around and as tall as a Statue of Liberty. At 1,000 to 1,800 years old, or possibly more, some may predate the Roman Empire. Wow. They predate the Roman Empire. And that's something? Damn. More recently, Big Basin ancient trees provided the setting um, of a forest walk that James Stewart and Kim Novak taken at an uh, Alfred Hitchcock movie, Vertigo. Um, Ethan Barron, a business tech reporter at the Mercury News in San Jose, California, he posted photos to his Twitter account today showing the devastation that the fire has caused among those majestic trees. Oh, God, it's horrible. Man. Wow. And then he writes, the CZU complex fire and nearby and the SCU complex have blackened two 129,000 acres thus far, making it the seventh largest fire in the state's history. It has destroyed nearly 100 structures and threatens over 20,000 others. Despite over 1,000 fire personnel working for the last past three days, the blazes remain 5 and 10% contained, respectively. Damn. Okay, here's a more the update. Uh, Raging Metro, and this is Santa Cruz County. 63,000 acres, 5% containment, 97 structures destroyed, 24,000 structures threatened, 77,000 people were evacuated. The redwood, the redwood trees are fire adapted. So the fact that they have burnt doesn't mean the end of them. Big Basin in particular has benefited from the longest continuous program of prescribed burning anywhere in the state since the purposeful burning done by indigenous people. In 1904, Big Basin was ablaze and at the time, the New York Times said the forest seems doomed for destruction, but it wasn't. Big Bear Big Basin, I mean, recovered. I'm thinking Big Bear because I, that's in Northern California. And that's, this is this is Northern California, if I'm not mistaken. Anyway, in fact, anything that's been around this state for centuries has probably survived its share of wildfires. But the twin threats of human encroachment and climate change are profound added stressors. Only 4% of the state's original redwood stands remain. 
Yeah. Earlier today, California Governor Gavin Newsom asked that Pro President Donald Trump declare a major disaster for his state. Good luck with that. Donald Trump um, thinks that if you don't like him, if you don't do what he says, then your state is not part of the United States. That's the kind of crazy, uh, psychotic person you're dealing with. We have a federal request in a bipartisan request to get a major disaster declaration here in the state of California, said Governor Newsom. Newsom declared declaration would, of course, provide more funds to the state, but also allow it to be more flexible in its wildfire response. In an update on Friday morning, California Fire said it was expected to see significant fire growth. Wow. Extreme fire behavior with short and long range spotting are continuing to challenge firefighting efforts, said the agency. Fires continue to make runs in the multiple directions and impacting multiple communities. They don't know what they're going to do. It's out of control. Wow. Well, like I said, my prayers uh, and my heart goes out to all of y'all out there in the Cal Northern California. I hope you stay safe, um, and I hope you don't lose too much. But as long as you get out safe and have a way to recover, then um, that's the most important thing in spite of um, how it feels. I know you might lose everything. But if you still got yourself, then you can start over again, no matter what. You have to. Uh, so, y'all be blessed. And with that being said, if you like what you hear, y'all, please give, leave your comments below. Anybody out there from California, anybody out there can give me any information about um, that boots on the ground. Um, have you had to evacuate? Do you know anybody that has evacuated? Um, what does it be like? And how far is uh, the Big Bear Resort from um, where all this fire is taking place? So, leave your comments below. Let me know what's going on. And somebody be my boots on the ground. All right. I'll see, here, see you in the next video. If you like what you hear, please share this video. And we're trying to get these um, uh, uh, subscribers up, y'all. So, I'm going to be more concentrating on bringing better content and better equipment. And I'm hoping that y'all can share these videos, like these videos, and um, let's get this subscriber count up, okay? All right. And the likes. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.